hello everyone and welcome back in this video we will learn how we can uh, format our graphs in the software so there are different ways you can modify the graphs in the software itself so you don't have to export the data and plot in other software such as python uh, maybe excel or origin okay so for example let's say you want to add a subscript or a superscript that can be done easily using the x level and y level feature so uh, we'll go one by one and uh, see how we can change the values so i'll just duplicate one of the plot here and this is just for tutorial okay and i'll open this now in the x level you see it's written real z omega m sub 2 sup so what it means is backslash omega will return the omega symbol as you can see it here and there is a m so here is a m and it is superscript so sup and then 2 and then sup close so this part will actually help us to write the superscript so instead of two if we write six and click on plot you see here we have six similarly uh, there are other ways also i will just remove this one now and let's say i want to write abc uh, maybe resistance okay so now i have resistance here now what i can do uh, I can write here B and here I can write B as well and if I click on plot you see what it does is this syntax will help us to bold a particular text so we had resistance but in the middle region we divided the part in such a way that one of the part lies in between the B so this part will be rendered as bold so you can see resistance it is rendered as bold similarly uh, you can write italics as well so if I change this to I and click on plot it will change into italics okay uh, to underline the text uh, we have to write as U click on plot and now you see that the text is underlined okay you can always put a space something like this and again to add a superscript you add sup or subscript sub and maybe write 5 l and again sub okay so if we click on plot so you see you now have subscript okay so this is how you syntax it now remember if you have worked with html and uh, xml you must have come across this kind of syntax so it is quite similar this is like opening the subscript uh, the front slash this is actually closing the subscript and in between whatever is there it will be rendered in that function so this is how you basically decorate the x and y levels uh, similarly you can change font as well from the settings so these things are done now let us go through few of the predefined function that are there in the software so i will just remove this now for example if you want to write gamma then you just have to write uh, backslash G A M M A and now you see you have a gamma here okay similarly uh, for every uppercase you also have a lowercase so if you write it as gamma in lowercase you will have the lowercase gamma okay so you can do all this for example very common is theta so you have theta here uh, we can have pi uh, omega psi so if i write psi 
and click on plot then i will have psi uh, similarly for example if you want to write uh, psi square so you have to write superscript sup then 2 then sup again and if you click on plot now you have psi square and also you can do the same uh, in the x-axis as well this is just for uh, demonstration this is nothing like uh, real stuff so let's say you want to plot psi square with x square you can have all this so these are a few of the command that you need to know if you want to plot directly in console also there are like mathematical symbol as well so uh, if you want to write the approximate symbol then you can write a p p r o x and click on plot then you will have the approximate symbol uh, if you want to write uh, the partial symbol you can also have that so this is the partial symbol and there are other as well for example the square root you can write sqrt click on plot then you have the sqrt symbol so all this you can uh, play with uh, i will try to link uh, uh, article or maybe i will try to write the command in the description of this video so that uh, you can check uh, if uh, you need any particular symbol okay so for example if you want to write degree then backslash deg and you will have the degree symbol so for example a degree c you can do that i hope that this video will be useful to create your uh, plots so that you can directly export the plot from the software and you don't have to waste time uh, exporting into some other software and putting in a template so thanks for watching if you like this video do subscribe and give a like and yeah thanks for watching have a nice day ahead